to everyone. Thank you very much for joining us. And thank you, um, Con Nuzit and the Heinz Center um, for uh, co-hosting this event with us. Um, my particular thanks to uh, Tom Gazoi, uh, Chair of the staff uh, of the GIF. Uh, today, uh, we will be, um, you will be seeing this on a report published by staff. And I have been extremely excited with this uh, report, uh, say the climate change, a scientific assessment. This report is meant to guide the GIF uh, in its long-term uh, visioning exercise, which I uh, kicked off uh, recently, but also uh, uh, it is meant to guide us for a medium-term fundraising exercise. So it's very, very important to us. Uh, but I want to tell you there are three reasons I am particularly excited with this report, but also having this um, uh, say outreach event. The first reason is this report confirms that we are on the wrong track in terms of global environmental management. We are dangerously close to the limits of safe planetary boundaries, and we are racing with time. So it is critical and so urgent for us to raise awareness, and as just Tom mentioned, that another staff is very good at giving us a good advice. However, maybe together with Jeff and staff, we may be a little short of telling the world that that kind of you know things are going out there. So to me, this and raising awareness is one of the things I really wanna uh, do going forward. And I did really uh, do appreciate Tom to uh, take this initiative. The second reason I was really excited with this report is its contents, contents of the advice, advice on us that Jeff. Uh, the report makes it crystal clear that incremental improvement of the, uh, the way a global environment is managed will not suffice. We need a transformational change um, to arrest this very, very worrisome downward spiral situation and the report calls us, call for the Jeff to move away from a traditional, conventional, single technology uh, or component specific approach to a more systemic, uh, holistic um, approach, which may uh, encompass uh, uh, the various uh, uh, dimensions of the issues, uh, say technological innovation, uh, uh, policy and regulation, uh, development, capacity building, and a uh, um, uh, demand side management, the various issues are uh, in it. So, um, this will be a departure from the um, quite a traditional conservative way that Jeff has been operated, but we wholeheartedly uh, agree on the, the advice given to us. Um, because we all know that the challenge we are facing is a multidisciplinary, multidimensional, and we need a solution uh, which uh, also uh, is a multidisciplinary um, and uh, at a holistic. So um, that's the second reason I was so excited with the report. And the third reason, the last reason, but not the least, is that the uh, um, uh, we appreciate the policy decisions based on the science and uh, the interface between science community and the policy making are so important and we want the institution like us, the Jeff, really want the scientists to be our critical partners. So with all those reasons, um, I'm excited and I hope you are also excited and you are also inspired um, the newly uh, coming, it's uh, not well, new anymore, it's already six months, but then uh, newly coming the CEO of the Jeff, I am quite determined to 
um, to to play uh, to make the Jeff play a catalytic role. Uh, well, a champion global commons, and but the Jeff on its own can really a, a catalyze a transformational change. We need a partner and we need a platform. Um, so that uh, every important uh, stakeholders are able to, to join uh, not only the government, or, uh, not only central government, but the uh, uh, local government, um, the, the private sector, industry, supplier, consumer, and every citizen of the of the um, uh, this globe needs to play its role. And we are very much determined to, the Jeff is determined to play a catalytic role to create that kind of platform. And we need a scientist as our, as our critical partner. So uh, today I'm really interested in hearing um, first from uh, distinguished panelists, uh, but also hoping that uh, there may be a, a good opportunity to hear from you directly with your new ideas that are uh, uh, fresh thinking to uh, bring this coalition uh, much more uh, to strong, um, um, the robust and strong. So today uh, we have a wonderful uh, panel, um, uh, Pavan, Joe, Ralph, and, uh, and Rosina. Um, in fact, uh, Rosina is nominated to succeed from uh, Lapsoy as the chair of the staff, and uh, we are quite uh, um, um, looking forward to, to also working with her. So with that, then, um, thank you so much, and please enjoy this particular occasion. Thank you so much.